Hello, I'm Scott Gassage with Haas Automation, and joining me today is John Nelson, Director of Applications with Thanks, Haas. Scott. How are you? Doing well, thanks. So today we want to talk to people about our dual spindle lathes. Dual spindle lathes help you increase your productivity, allowing you to do one and done operations, reduce your setups, and ultimately help you make parts faster. Now John, when I talk to a lot of customers, dual spindle machines can sometimes be intimidating. There's two spindles, what type of programming, the fact that I can exchange parts, how do I do that? That can be a real, real challenge for some customers. How have we made that easy? It's actually really simple. I've got a part in here that's, um, that's our, our demo part. It's already machined on operation one. I've got the B-axis positioned ready to grab it. All we do is start the spindles, give it one G-code to synchronize those spindles. We open the chuck on the secondary spindle, come in, grab the part, release it with the main spindle, pull back, and we're already machining operation two. So all that synchronization happens with a single G-code? Yep. Can we, can we see it operate? Sure. Okay, so I can see the spindle coming up. Yeah, you can see the jaws clamp. You can see the little unclamp. Wow, that's incredibly simple. And this is the actual part that we're making here. Yeah. Now, we're starting to work on the second spindle. How do I program on the second spindle? Do I have to now, instead of everything being a Z minus move like it is off the face of the part, do I have to think Z plus? How, how do I program on the, on the second spindle? No, not at all. That's way too complicated. So on the Haas control, we have one code, uh, G14. And essentially what G14 does is mirrors all of the Z axis motion and any spindle commands that you've given. So essentially you can take a program that was written for a single spindle machine, operation one, flip the part over and programmed operation two. You can take those two bits of code, put them in this machine with a G14 in between, and the machine will take care of mirroring all the motion over to the second spindle. 